Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Devil Survival Let's Play series. I'm sorry, it has been quite a while and excuse me, one moment. Uh, nom nom. Yep, got, gotta get some food because of that huddling right there, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I do not have the best of armor on me right now. Um, but anyways, welcome back to Nether Survival. Um, I'm sorry it has been quite a while since the last episode, but um, if you have been watching my Minecraft tutorials lately, my three tutorials, farm tutorials specifically, that I've been uploading, then uh, yeah, that that's why it has taken quite a while to do those. But uh, anyways, we are back now, and if you have seen those farms, well, stay tuned, because uh, I'm going to need them in the series later on. But anyways, you may have spotted something in this vicinity that is quite new. Um, have you spotted it? Let me know down in the comments below. Anyways, that is that right there. Yes, indeed, a doo doo. <laughs> you can now get gold in the nether. It is really cool. And I am out here in new generated terrain. And we're going to be mining gold. Uh, oh, dear. I thought we were going to be mining gold. Um, my pickaxe broke. <laughs> but yes, we will be mining gold. Um in today's episode and hopefully be doing a bunch of bartering because I also in this episode if we can I really want to get a respawn anchor um, yeah because that that that's gonna be really cool then we don't need that portal over there actually so that's gonna be really cool also you can get iron from bartering with piglins so that is gonna be amazing if we can get that so yeah that is my hope for today uh, I might as well make a bunch of pickaxes here because I'm gonna need them eventually, so I might as well. Uh, you know what, I better make an axe too, because I need to be able to defend myself. And I did not take one of my spare swords with me. This is the issue with wooden tools. They work in the nether. Like, they work, you can break stuff and such. But the durability is so low. It's painful. <laughs> you use so much wood, but anyways. Um, so these gold ores, you can mine them with uh, wooden tools even. Um, I don't think you can mine them with your bare hands. I don't think yet. Yeah, you don't get netherrack from bare hands when you just mine that. So I doubt that. It, I think that's the same with gold. I don't think you'll get anything um, from that. But I don't remember the exact number. Um, you do get more gold um, if you're using fortune. Right now, until now, I have gotten like five per ore. Until like now, I got like what was that? Two or three. Um, but this is quite a good. This is quite a big vein right here. So twenty-one. So as you may know, uh, notice up oh, there. I only got two. Um, as you may notice, I'm getting gold nuggets from this. If I had a silk touch pickaxe, I could smelt it into an entire ingot, which is pretty cool. Um, with fortune three, I believe you can get. The max we can get is like 23 nuggets, but I mean, so far, we have 44 gold. That was just from one gold vein. That's not too bad. You know what? I, I want to know this. Best. Oh, dear. Oh, there's gold up there, actually. Um, But I want to know this specific. So, hold on. Let me look at the wiki. All right. Here it is. Another gold ore drops two to six gold nuggets when mined with any pickaxe. Fortune has a 33.3% chance to multiply the drops. By two, Fortune two has a twenty-five percent chance to multiply and multiply the drops by two or three, and Fortune three has a twenty percent chance to multiply the drops by two, three, or four for a maximum possible drop of twenty-four gold nuggets. So I was a little bit wrong there. I'll leave a link to the microfigure down below in the description if you want to check it out. Um, also, my life is in danger if a huglin is nearby, mainly because their range is like stupidly crazy. Okay, it's not stupid, but it's crazy and it's dangerous for me and I'm scared. <laughs> uh, oh wait, there's go. Oh no. Uh, 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 get up. Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it's quite bad. <laughs> uh, it's quite bad, but um, let me get some more netherrack here. Yeah, they're much, they're much harder for me to kill now. Um, like a lot harder. Where was that gold? There was gold in... Piglin, help me! Oh, there's gold right there! That's actually quite a bit of gold here. I'm not gonna complain. Where is it? Oh, right here. Ah! You see what I mean? Piglin, help me! Okay, let's get this gold and let's not... Oh, thank you, Piglin! Oh, thank you! I'll let you have that meat, buddy. You deserve that. <laughs> the Piglin just saved me. 
that that's pretty cool. Um, oh, there's gold down there too. Okay, so it actually, hmm, it's actually not as rare as I thought it would be. That's cool. That's gold up there. That's gold there, and that's gold there. Ooh, this is a lot of gold. Like, look at the gold we have so far. Like, look at it. How many ingots is that? Uh, I'm actually not sure. Let's try and see. So far, that is seven. Wait, nope. Ten gold ingots. Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's quite a lot, actually. This is going to make my life so much easier. We can get a full set of golden armor with this. Um, oh, that's even here. We can get a full set of golden armor with this. Plus, well, not with the current gold that we have right now. But I mean, oh dear. But I mean, you get the idea. I get mine here for a, for a little bit and actually get quite a bit of gold. Oh, there's even more there. <laughs> okay, I gotta remember the stuff in the roof. Hold on. Now, on the wiki, you can also find the, um, I believe, the chances for how much will spawn in a chunk or something like that you can go and go ahead and look at those details if you want again the link for the gold or nether gold or it's in the description down below but look at this this is pretty cool i like this addition i like this a lot before i had to go to nether fortresses to uh, to get gold and hope that i would find gold and hope that i would find a decent amount hope that i would even find some gold um, did I not see some more? Pretty sure I saw more. Um, but now I can just go here and just walk around. Well, of course, hope that I have enough mushrooms to survive. But other than that, I mean, not too bad. Not too bad. Would be perfect if I had like a fortune pickaxe, but I don't. So that's that. But I mean, hey, it's pretty cool. Also, I gotta go remember the gold down there. <laughs> Gold for me is valuable. But yeah, this is pretty, pretty cool. Um, so I'm hoping I can use this gold to... I'm not sure if I'm going to make armor with it. I mean, it certainly would help me. But then again, gold armor isn't that great. But I don't know yet. Um, What I really want to do, I really want to use it to barter with piglins to get crying obsidian so I can get the respawn anchor in this episode, as I mentioned. Um, oh no. But I also... Uh, really want to get iron as well, so I can get like maybe just so I can get iron tools. <laughs> I want iron tools, maybe iron armor if we if we can get that much. Um, that would be amazing. So yeah, I I don't know how how much gold I'm gonna get here. Um, I have been here mining this for eight minutes now. This video is like eight minutes. Um, and I mean we all already got pretty much. Let's see how much we got now. From like what is that five minutes of mining or so let's see uh 20 gold ingots i can't complain i can't complain at all <laughs> i can't really complain um now i of course just gotta find more i mean there's more up there of course the thing oh never mind i was about to say of course the thing is is to find it but i mean eh. okay so not all veins uh, spawn very oh dear, spawn very rich um, like some of them that we saw before sometimes they spawn just like this it would seem but I mean yeah that's that's pretty cool that makes my life a whole lot e oh dear, a whole lot easier down here in the nether oh and I guess we have a fortress here um, okay not really what I was expecting to do I'm gonna look around here for some more see if I can find some more gold um, and yeah mine it we got gold and then the fact that you don't have to go branch mining and mining it <coughs> sorry hey my voice died you don't have to go mining for it you could just go look and then be like oh there's some oh there's also some you don't have to be branch mining and stuff or find a cave i mean you can use a cave you can use a cave in the nether to find it i suppose um or i guess it can spawn in the nether caves I don't know, but the point is, you don't have to go mining in order to get it, like branch mining in the old world. That's pretty cool. Also, that is death. I'm not going to stand near that. Not with this amount of gold on me. <laughs> I don't want to die with this. That 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 would be um, that would be very bad. What I really got to be careful of is not 
to look at an enderman. If I look at an enderman, I'm gonna be dead. Also, I saw some gold down there, so I'm gonna try and get down there with my life somewhat intact. I think I can get down there from over here. Yep, there it is. I suppose we should go and check out that fortress. There might be gold on it. Uh, we might even find some diamonds, of course. So that fortress is actually a pretty cool find. So I'm gonna go and check it out and... Uh, hope I don't die, because then I'm gonna lose a lot of this gold. Uh, <laughs> which would be really sad. Uh, is it even worth it to go to the fortress? I mean, it is worth it, but... Is it worth it while I have this much gold on me? I don't know, to be honest with you. I don't know if it's worth it while I'm stacking this much gold. Um, I'm also not sure if it's worth it to be near lava like this. <laughs> uh, not sure if that's worth it either. But yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna go over to the fortress. If things look very bad, I can always just, hopefully always just make a chest, uh, make a chest, store the stuff, and then die if I'm fast. You know what, I think I'm gonna even make a chest. I'm gonna craft a chest. I'm gonna have it in my inventory. And no. And uh, if I get close to death, I can just place it and hopefully quickly get the gold. Um, in my inventory. Man, I'm losing some here. Eh, there we go. Got it. So yeah, I think we're gonna head over to the, to the fortress. Maybe it will lead us to some more gold. And uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll be right back. I'll meet you at the fortress. Maybe I won't meet you at the fortress. Um, that's quite that's quite a bridge to make. That is quite a bridge to make. Um, ah, 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 ow! Dang it! Yeah. That's quite a bridge to make. Okay, after that, um... Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over there and try and move around. Um, that way I'll get gold on the way and I should be able to end up over here if I go in a circle. As long as I don't die, um... From getting attacked by a Hawkland or something. So, I'm gonna move around and I'll be back if something interesting happens. How about that? And no, that does not count as interesting. Does it? I don't know. Maybe if it does in a stupid situation. <laughs> Anyways, I'll be right back. Also, have I shown you these yet? I don't think I have these, um... Uh... Twisting vines. You can actually climb up. Like, that's pretty cool. I don't think... Yeah, I don't have any of those back home. So, I think... Um, does it not break all of them? But yeah, I'm gonna take some of these with me, um, because, yeah, th those are pretty cool. Alright, I'm gonna try and make my way around. Oh dear. Remember the thing I said, I said with the pickaxe breaking? Yeah. I'm gonna run out of wood at this point. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of wood at this point. Alright, I am here. Alive. Um... <laughs> So far, anyway. That was quite... Okay. Oh, gold. But, uh, yeah, that... We were, like, over there mining some gold just before. And, uh, yeah, you can see the Hawkland and the island that was over there. Um, so I made some progress. And now I, I have found gold. So that's good. That's good. Uh, I'll be there at the fortress eventually. <laughs> this is a beautiful sight. This amount of gold right here. Right here. It, it's just a beautiful sight. I'm not going through there. No, 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 no. You know, I'm... I'm starting to very much dislike the Crimson Forest. <laughs> the fortress is right there. Assuming that I can make the journey through this Crimson Forest. Oh, there's gold there, though. There's gold. I want that. Oh, dear. Uh, it sees me. Okay. Uh, you know what? I can I can get it on the on the on the way home. I can get it on the way home. No, no, that's more. Um, issue is the babies attack you as well. Wait, is this a dead? This is a dead, 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 dead end. Dead, dead. Okay, you'll hear up, 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 up. 
Okay, um, let's see. Uh, the fortress is right there. I think if I just go up, I should hopefully be able to make it. Maybe. Uh, assuming I don't fail in some stupid way, which... Which, knowing me, that's probably gonna happen. More gold. Why did it have to be Crimson Crimson Forest? Uh, I miss the old Hucklins with their attack range. <laughs> you actually stood a chance. I stand a very small chance with their current range. I, I really hope that get fixed. Or tweaked. I assume maybe... I guess it's on purpose, but I don't know. Um, but yeah, I, I hope it gets tweaked. All right. Very happy to say that we are very close to the fortress, and there's plenty of gold here. Not a good sign is three wither skeletons waiting for me. Um, yeah, that's... Not sure if that's good news or not. Um, but yeah, uh, yay, another fortress. You know what would be so, so sad? Well, it would be cool, but also, Mojang, please don't add it. Um, where piglins, maybe even pigmen, got angry at you if you were mining gold ore. Um, that that would be <laughs> that would be a pain <laughs> if that were to happen. Look at this gold! Just a bit more, and we actually have a full stack of gold ingots. <laughs> oh wait, there's more here. A full stack of gold ingots just from mining. That's amazing. You know, this could be an issue. Okay. All right. For real this time. Oh, there's a blaze there. Oh, this is a this is a really bad spot for me to be. Uh, I need to get to the fortress asap without dying. It. I see a chest there. Um. Yeah, without dying in the process. Huh? Okay, I'm just gonna go here. Gonna hide for a bit. Eh. Eat some mushroom stew. Hopefully that I'll find hope that I find some more mushrooms. That with a skeleton is gonna come right after me. Um I can assume that much. Okay, so if I jump and run over there and then quickly block the entrance. Oh wait, I can't jump that. I need to jump here. Oh, wait a second. Huh? Huh? Hi. Okay, so you, my friend, are gonna be an issue. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, where did you land? I mean, I wouldn't mind killing you. Oh, he's right there. But that's Hucklins. Yeah, I'd rather just invite myself in. Huh? Huh? Okay. Yeah, I'd rather just invite myself in. Thank you. Oh, two chests, okay. I mean, I'm mainly hoping for diamonds here. I mean, gold can work too. Gold will, gold, gold will work. <laughs> what do we have? Okay. I mean, I can't, I can't complain. I can't complain at all right now. Uh, another chest. I mean, this is a good start for a, um... Iron! That's three iron ingots. Yes! Ah! That's so great! That's amazing! Woo! That's amazing. Okay, wait, what can I get rid of? Uh, my inventory is getting a little bit cluttered. Okay, it's fine. Another chest. Another chest. Three diamonds. Iron. A lot of gold. Okay, I th oh, grab that. That's valuable. Okay, you know what? I'm going to leave old wooden tools here because I need inventory space. You know what? This... This fortress, another chest. This fortress might be one of the best fortresses that we've. Yep, this is the best fortress we've ever found. This is the best fortress we've ever found, guys. Eight iron ingots. Eight iron ingots. Okay, we go down. What does this lead to? Eight iron ingots so far. Now I'm really happy that we went in here. Eight iron ingots from this fortress. That's amazing. Oh wait, I see another chest. This goes up. Uh, here. A gold. I mean, I guess I'll take the golden chest plate because I'm gonna need it. Okay, up. What does that lead to? I mean, mushrooms are valuable. I see another chest there. If we can get to that, that'd be great. 
But yeah, I'm gonna take these mushrooms. Because that's gonna be useful, of course. That's food. Okay, uh... Okay, yeah, I don't think I'm... I don't think I'm... Yeah, I don't think I should be outside. I'm, I'm gonna go back inside. Oh, wait. Was that it before? I'm gonna take it. I'm taking it. I need, I need red mushrooms to survive. <laughs> I need red mushrooms. Uh... Where did I come from? Did I check this? I did. Okay. Uh, let me find the other way. That pig man scared me. I don't know if you saw him, but he just turned around this corner and scared me. Not very nice of you. I'll take the iron horse armor. Because those can be turned into iron nuggets, so that's useful. But yeah, I'll be back if I find something interesting or something interesting happens. So stay tuned, I'll be right back. Ah! That's a place! And I don't have the correct weapon out to deal with this pigment. Take cover. Eh. I don't. I'm, I'm not dying. I'm not dying. Ow. Gick. Told you I'm not dying yet. Not today. I think I just heard a skeleton. Eh. Die. Okay. Ah, uh, there's another one up there. That's a chest, though. Wait. I see that with a skeleton there. It just jumped down after me. Okay. Can't get to me. That's good. Ah! Nope. Goodbye. I want the chest. I want the chest. <laughs> I'd like to live. Oh, there's another up here. That's not good. More iron! Yes! Yes! That's good. Oh, wait. Another one. More gold. Okay, this... This fortress is the best that we've seen so far, I think, in the series. Oh, gold. Oh, it does a chest. <laughs> I love this place. I'm, I'm, I'm saving these uh, coordinates. <laughs> Whoa. I love this fortress. Get me up here. Eh. More diamonds. What do we... I think we have six diamonds back at home. This is like 11 diamonds. You pretty much get diamond armor at this rate. Okay, what do we have here? Just a dead end. I would like to get up there, because may you never know. Oh dear. That's a gas as well. Um okay, you never know. But oh, man, this this is the best fortress we've seen so far. The only thing that worries me right now is food, because I only have one red mushroom. Um But I mean this is wait, did I? Okay, I did loot that. Okay, good. But yeah, this fortress is like the best we've come across so far. Ten iron ingots. Six, uh, five diamonds, sixteen gold ingots. Yeah, this is uh, this is big. Now I want to get up here. Do I use my arrows for this? I really, I think, I feel like I can take it. Huh? Huh? Eh? Eh? And eh? I hear another skeleton. Oh, there's a skeleton right there. Block, block. Eh. Come on. Thank you. I'll take... Uh, I can get rid of that. I want the coal. Diamond horse armor. Unfortunately, can't convert that into diamond nuggets. Uh, okay, nothing here. Nothing here. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can't really stay out for too long here. So I think I want to get outside if I can. And try and get on top. Um, did I do this? I did. <laughs> Starting to forget where I've been. I want to get up to some of the. Yeah. Okay, you aren't as deadly. Never mind. You actually are. You actually are. <sighs> I mean, I could craft a shield right now. You know what? A shield would actually be really helpful. I think we're gonna do that. Oh, never mind. I don't have enough wood with me. I do not have enough wood with me. I uh, don't have enough wood to make the shield. Okay. I think I might need to just call it good with the looting of this place. Because I'm running low on food. I only have these two left and one more still. And even though there are more to explore from this place, I think... I'm gonna be done here. I saw 
huge load of mushrooms over there. So I think we will be trying to get those. Uh, even though they're brown. Yeah, but maybe we'll find some red too. Um, but yeah, I think I don't want to overstay my welcome here because... Well, I don't want to die. <laughs> Dying now would be terrible. Um, so yeah, let me get some of this gold. Let me just look around, maybe find some red rock mushrooms. And I'll be right back. Oh, never mind. Red mushrooms right here. But yeah, let me be back um, if something interesting happens. Let me gather some of this stuff. And I'll be right back. Alright, so the fortress is quite big. But this is, of course, all outside stuff. Which I'm not that huge of a fan. And look at that. That's like... Five, five, yeah, five with us got to the place. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's much more for me to come after. I mean, I could drop down here and see what's up. Uh, assuming that there's a path to it. No, there's not actually. Um, I think I just gotta, I think I'm just gonna go home actually. I'm gonna save the coordinates for this place. Um, but yeah, I think I don't want to say my welcome, I don't want to die here. Uh, did I go there? I think I... Did I place those? I don't recall placing those. So I don't think I did. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna head home. Or figure out how to get home anyway. And yeah, I'll be back. I'll either meet you back home. Or I'll be back if something interesting happens. Uh, oh dear. This is the last pickaxe I can make. So I will probably have to stop by a fort... Not a fortress. A forest to get some more wood. But anyways, I'll be right back. Either back home or if something interesting happens. Stay tuned. I have actually run out of storage in my inventory to carry all this gold. We have over a stack of golden ingots just from mining gold. With a wooden pickaxe. Like, that's amazing. <laughs> Alright, and we are home with a completely full inventory though i must say that was definitely worth it it has definitely been worth it let's get inside and let me actually show you uh, something i made before i left base um yeah i don't know why i haven't thought of this before but you can actually make barrels with this wood so i have um reorganized my stuff so this chest or this barrel is for wood uh, the red wood blue wood then we got soul sand and gravel. We got in here we got quartz and we got bone blocks. And in this one we have like other plants and such. In fact, these go in here. Um, mushrooms, bone meal that is already made bones that is already made into bone meal, and glowstone and shroom lights. And then the big chest is for well valuable stuff and tools and stuff like that then down here we have mob drops and here we have other blocks like nether bricks and obsidian and blah 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 you see what i mean but anyways let us take a look at what we got so we got five diamonds i'm going to convert these horse armor into um into nuggets because yeah nuggets are stackable and nuggets can be crafted into ingots and that's what we want um we have 16 gold ingots and those are not even from mining, those are from the fortress, as well as iron ingots, which is amazing. And of course the five diamond, let's put that in there. And of course we have 15 gold nuggets in here already. Um, yeah, that is pretty a successful run, I must say. Very, very successful indeed. I'm also going to convert this uh, golden sword. Hey, yeah, I'm going to convert the golden sword. Don't need it. Don't think I need it. Um... But yeah, that's pretty cool. Now, this episode is already quite long, uh, so I think I'm going to cut it here. And then in the next episode, we will be, well, bothering with some piglins. But let's first of all see how much gold we actually got from this mining session if we convert it into into um, into ingots. So, like, that's, that's 64 gold ingots right there. And if we convert the rest of these nuggets... Uh, there we go, and boom, look at that, a stack at 24, sorry, a stack and 25 gold ingots from our mining expedition. That is not bad at all. I will probably be using most of these for battering, um, 
to get the stuff that I really want. But if I have a lot remaining, I might go ahead and make some a full set of gold armor just to protect myself a little bit more. And do let me know. Uh, also, because we have these 60, so I might use those 60 from the fortress for that, actually. But, um... We also have diamonds, uh, quite a few now actually, and also iron. So let me know what you think we should be doing with the iron and the diamonds down in the comments below. Um, what you think would be best to use the diamonds and the iron for? Armor? Tools? I don't know. Yeah, you let me know. <laughs> I need ideas, so let me know down in the comments below. Um, but yeah, that's actually not too bad. I'm gonna put these right here themselves because we're gonna use those in the next episode but anyways hope you enjoyed this one if you did be sure to leave a like as always and uh, yeah hope you enjoyed hope to see you next time a wonderful day and goodbye